What is going on guys and welcome back to the YouTube channel. Uh, today is exciting because I'm going to Spain. Um, I'm competing at, at the EM Pro Classic on Sunday. Um, today is Thursday so we are flying out a couple of days earlier. Um, yeah this was kind of a decision I made a couple of weeks back. Uh, basically just going for experience. Um, it's a massive international show. Uh, with there's pro cards up for grabs, so you know um, I'm basically going out there, no expectations at all. I'll be honest, um, you know I, I'm not expecting anything. Um, being my first season and all that, jumping straight into a big international show like this, um, I haven't expected anything all season anyway, you know. But yeah, I'm just going for the experience. I'm going for a holiday, <laughs> uh, but no, yeah, I'm going to see how. They do it abroad um, on the big stages. It's one of the biggest stages in Europe, I think. VB Arenas or something like that. Uh, but anyway, I'm about to check in. Um, a little bit about this week, actually. My weight has been dropping and dropping and dropping. And we've been increasing food. Um, I think we've had an extra five, 600 carbs over the last sort of three days. And my weight is still down. So... We're going to check in now. I'll show you that real quick and then we wait for my reply from Rob um, and then we'll get cracking with the day. So that is checking done, guys. I'm going to send it over to Rob now and wait for his reply for the day. I have no idea how day today is going to work. Um, this is my first uh, sort of flight where I've had to stick to the, you know a diet, a meal plan um, and steps and all sorts. So today's a complete rest day anyway, so I don't have to worry about any training. I managed to do um, all of my client work that I needed to do. Um, so today is just literally about getting there, but food is my only worry. Um, I usually eat seven meals a day, so um, that's probably going to be impossible. Um, obviously during checking in to the airport and then obviously landing, I can't take no food through. And I can't see the airport having any food suitable for me um at this this close to the competition now i don't want to be swapping changing food so that's not really an option but when he gets back to me um i let you guys know the plan and let you know what i'm gonna do uh, it's gonna be a big learning curve but i'm excited so yeah i'll get back to you when rob gets back to me so i've had my reply from rob um and we're gonna run a higher carb day, I've um, been running high high carb days all week to try and keep me full because my weight has been dropping and dropping and dropping. Um, so today we're on about two and a half thousand calories. Obviously it's a rest day, no training at all because of the flight and all sorts. Um, food wise, obviously I can't take creamy rice on the plane because it's like, um, obviously it's a liquid. So I've had to switch up for normal rice. So I've prepped my meals. Um, we got chicken and rice, we got chicken sandwiches as well. So. Um, that's going to be nice, but yeah, I'm just about to leave for Spain, guys, uh, so I'll keep you updated. Obviously, so I've got a meal on the plane where um, it's just chicken, 
rice and peanut butter and I'll show you guys now. So staying on track was easier than I thought to be honest. So we're gonna land um, and then I'm gonna have my oats and all that when I get to the apartment because I took them in my bag so we can make our food when we get there then. So we're just outside guys and the heat man hit me straight away. I haven't been on holiday since like pre-COVID. So uh, we're just getting a taxi now. We've got boss man with our uh, with our luggage. Straight to the apartment um, and then maybe we'll go shopping. I don't know, maybe I'll just have a walk around. We'll see. Um, I haven't got really got any plans, it's a rest day, like I said, so um, we, I might just go and have a little walk around, a bit of an ex exploration, um, and then probably go shopping early in the morning, to be honest, because I got my food sorted for today. So, um, yeah, next, guys, I'll show you the apartment we're staying in. So we are guys at the apartment um, and it's banging fit place, everything we need. Uh, I'll show you around now. So we have a nice kitchen space. Um, that's obviously needed for me prepping my meals and everything. So we've got a full kitchen, massive TV. Um, we've got the settee, which is a full out double bed. Nice little dining area there. Um, show you on. We're, we're literally on the main. We're five minute walk from the main. Um, from the beach and all the, the bars and everything. Not that I'll be using them till Sunday anyway. But we're going in now um, to. We got the bathroom shower area, and then we got a double bed, nice room storage. TV and we've got a nice little outdoor area it's not like a balcony or anything like that but it's just a little uh, kind of like a little terrace absolutely boiling out here but yeah that's the apartment um, super happy with it aircon as well which is needed so I think we're just gonna chill now to be honest we're gonna have a look around five minute walk from the beach so might go down to the beach um, and yeah, just gonna enjoy the rest of the day. Now I got still got a couple of meals to get in as well. Um, so I'll probably have one in five, have one tonight, and then tomorrow we are carving up heavy. So there's actually a, a Mercadona, which is a supermarket, um, literally two minutes away, which is absolutely ideal. So yeah, um, I'll keep you updated on the rest of the day. So before we go to exploring, guys, um, like I said, I've got two meals left, so I'm gonna quickly have these. Um, I managed to bring most of my food with me. So we got oats and whey, and we got some dark chocolate. Here it is. So I'm gonna have this. Go out, have a little look around, and maybe go to the supermarket and get some chicken and things like that. And then yeah, we'll uh, I'll show you the town. So this place is banging, and I've already found my gym. It's literally two minutes away. Cosmopolitan Health and Fitness. It's got a sauna. Um, it's got a swim swimming pool. It's got absolutely everything. Literally two minutes away from my flat, so this is absolutely ideal um, for pumping up tomorrow. It's open at seven in the morning. It's pumping up on Sunday as well. So so far so good. Now I think we're going to head down uh, to the beach. Just speaking to someone who actually lives here, and she showed me where all the party places are. But um, I think she's rubbing salt in the wounds a bit. But yeah. So um, I'm going to show you the beach next, guys. Hey, <laughs> absolutely stunning out here. So I'm not gonna lie and say that this isn't killing me. <laughs> These oh. lot are on the top of us. Sangria. Sangria. Cheers. Pizzas. And I'm on absolutely nothing. <laughs> but we do have some scenes going on. So it's all good. 
So that's the first day done guys. Um, we went food shopping as well. It was quite difficult, I had to have Google Translate for everything. Um, so I'll show you quickly now, but we got this. It's a yogurt you can only get in Spain. Fanta Lemon, the diet version. But yeah, we managed to get everything ready for the carb up tomorrow. So we have basically our standard stuff, eggs, chicken. Found this protein yogurt, 50 grams of protein in there. Zero carbs, zero fats. Got our cocoa pops ready, salad, got some bread. And then obviously we still have, um, I brought like my creamy rice and oats and everything with me. Um, so I'm gonna have one more meal, which is gonna be the same as my last meal. Um, and then yeah, we're gonna go to bed, get up in the morning, ready for the carb up. Um, see what, well, see how many carbs I'm eating, see how much weight I've lost in the morning or gained. Probably lost loads, I think I've done 18,000 steps. But yeah, today's been a lot better than I thought really, a lot easier than I thought. So that's day one guys, um, and I'll catch you tomorrow.